hi guys welcome back to my channel so today i filmed this look um it is an autumn inspired butterfly look um i'm very proud of how i how i did it um shame it was a lot of struggleville but you know we got through it so if you want to see how i achieved this look then stay tuned okay so without wasting any more time let's just get into it so i'm going to prime my eyes um, for the eyeshadow using this um, Essence Camouflage Concealer in the color Light Honey and I'm also going to use on the outer side of my eyes I'm going to use the Essence Camouflage Plus Concealer in the color Golden Toffee Okay, so I'm going to take this and just put it on the inside of my eye and Then golden honey, golden toffee rubber on the outside. And I'm doing this because the golden toffee is a bit um what do you call this? Actually more. It's a bit like darker and it's not gonna be like it's not gonna be too light when I I don't know how to explain it. Golden toffee is the color I use to highlight my face. Okay, I look crazy, but yeah. And then I'm going to go in with my palette. This palette, and I'm going to go into the yellow color. And I'm going to put that color in on the inside of my eye. And I'm going to put on quite a bit. I'm going to go in with this brush. And I'm going to take the yellow color. Oh wow, the sun is lit. Mm, this is like the brightest color I have. So, um, you know what? We'll work with it. This is like the most experimental makeup I've ever done. Okay, so the yellow isn't coming out as much as I would like, so I'm going to go into my LA Girl um, Pro Contour with the highlight color and I'm going to just, um, not cut my crease, but I'm going to put the color here where I want the yellow to be. Just to make sure that the yellow is, has something to stick on. Okay, so I'm done with the yellow color. Now I'm going to go <coughs> into this orange color here. And I'm gonna put it next to the after the other time. Do you wanna use this brush? I'm gonna use this brush. So I'm just gonna put the orange color. Yeah. That's actually pretty. That looks really pretty! Ooh. Okay. Okay, so I'm sure we all see the whoopsie that happened here. So I'm just gonna go in with my translucent powder and my brush and just put the translucent powder by my eyebrow just to make sure that all my ooh, shadows blend nicely. Okay, so next I'm gonna go into my Makeup Resolution Soft Soul Fix palette and I'm gonna go into the color Pumpkin um, and I'm gonna put that on the outer area of my eye. And one thing I like about Fiji Resolution palettes is that they come with a mirror. I do not understand people who are able to do their eyeshadow after their. I'm able to do their eyeshadow after their makeup, like their face makeup. Like, there is so much fallout for me. And it's not even just like the products, it's just, I think it's the way I work with the products. Okay, so that's not coming out the way I would like, so I'm gonna use a different 
palette i'm gonna go into my makeup revolution the name is even off um reloaded velvet rose palette and i'm gonna go into this color which is like a brownie orange color I think I wanna go. Eggs. You were clown, you do it for lights. Hmm. Okay. And I'm gonna go out because I wanna do a rainbow look. Hmm. Do I wanna go up a bit? Blend, guys. Blend. I'm going to go back into the orange color and I'm just going to put that in the middle again just to, you know, emphasize. And I guess if you had been a bit neater, you could just finish up your face and you can rock this look of just as put on lashes or put on mascara. Hear me. But um going to now move on to my next step of this Okay, so I've just done the one side of my eye and gooby guys. Gooey, gooey. The lines are a lot thicker than I wanted them to be. Um That's what I'm gonna say, but I'm just gonna move on and hope that the second eye looks a bit better. And then, yeah. So, I'm gonna go with my Essence Super Lost Eyeliner in the color Deep Black. And I'm going to basically go and line my eye. And I think that's difficult. The thing that is difficult about this is. So I'm gonna go in on the inside of my eye and I'm just gonna make a line. This really requires a steady hand and I don't have a steady hand. Okay, let me do this. Um... Wow, you can't even see me. What's the point? You can kind of, yeah, going to there, this line is really thick, okay, and then after that, what did I do, I'm going to take, I'm going to go here, just, just by my crease, and I'm going to draw a line in, to my eye, towards my eye, towards the corner of my eye. eyes are really looking at the data. It's just too thick. I don't even know how to explain this. Guys. But like this looks a lot better already. But since my eyes have smelled, I think I'm just gonna make it thick also. Yeah. And I'm gonna draw my eye out a little bit more again. And I'm gonna make another line. And I'm gonna make another line in. Hey! 
Cave. You were gay too. This is so much better. What? And I can't fix it. It's black liner. I can't fix it. I think if I just done the other um, iron camera, it would have looked nicer. Okay, so we all agree that this eye looks better than this eye. But for the sake of uniformity, I'm going to make this eye a bit thicker too. Um, no, you know what? I can't fix this. I just can't fix the inside. So. Yo, guys, don't close your eyes while you're doing this. Because you're gonna look at me. I mean, in, so, in my defense, this is kind of the first time I'm doing like something this adventurous. Something that's out of the box. Okay. So, when my eyes kind of look the same, I think I'm gonna just um, make a few lines. I feel like butterflies have stuff like this. I'm gonna do the same thing on this side. Yeah. I'm just gonna kind of wait for my eyes to dry. Okay, so now I'm going to make white dots. I kind of tried to make one here. Um, just wanted to see how it looks without me going into the into uh, contour color. And yeah, it's not working. Highlight color, whatever. So I'm going to go into this and I accidentally got some of my liner into it. But it's okay. Um, and I'm going to put my brush in here. And then I'm going to go into my Soul X palette. And I'm going to go into this white color. Uh, this white color to make dots so let's see how that looks I need a bit of a smaller brush for this so, but I'm just gonna make the big dot mm, no okay that was that okay that looks cute I think this is a bit big. Let me get something smaller. Don't know what. Okay, I found the, the smallest brush I could find. I'm just gonna continue making dots. I need white liner. And I'm gonna go with this and just try to dust off the lash liner. It's not coming through as much as I would like. Maybe if I wet the brush. Okay, so guys, I've just gone into my concealer again. Um, the color and the color light honey. And I'm gonna go into the Magnify Eye Spice Edition by Rimmel. And I'm gonna go into that white color. Oops. And yeah, let's just stick this. 
okay so i've just done it with an earring and tried to make smaller dots on the eyes so now i'm just gonna go and do the rest of my face and i'm gonna come back and show you guys the finished product okay so i'm officially done guys and i just did my lips and if i know what i used for my lips um i used this rimmel liner in the color rich brown it's a rimmel exaggerate waterproof eye definer um in the color rich brown um my gosh liquid matte lipstick and this smudge clear lip gloss and that is the finished product let me know what you think in the comments down below honestly speaking i think i did really really well um for a first you know timer and yeah um i'm gonna be doing much more of these um more creative looks because shamelessly body and the only thing i can do is makeup so um yeah thank you guys so much for watching this is weird thank you guys so much for watching and please tune in to my next video and i'm so sorry about the song here um yeah thank you guys bye